hello everyone and welcome back to my channel so today we are going to learn how we can load two color into single stroke and i'm going to show you some simple flowers using uh, two colors in a single stroke technique today i'm going to use only one brush this is size 8 round brush and my sheet is a 300 gsm watercolor sheet and i'm going to use some basic color today so for the first flower i'm thinking to use uh, uh, yellow and orange color so today i'm going to use all the color which goes well with each other you can use any color whatever you like or whatever you like to combine uh, but uh, today i'm using all the color which goes well with each other so my first color is yellow and orange and uh, i'm mixing uh, a uh, little bit of white into orange to make it little lighter and uh, I'm also using brown color for the ovary of the flower so in the brown color I'm also mixing little hint of purple to make it a uh, little different variety of brown so let's start with the first flower so let's create first the ovary of the flower simple a uh, big circle of brown two circle like this and little dots of black now let's start with the first flower so i have these two colors one is light orange and second is yellow so i'm going to fill my brush with yellow color so i'm filling my brush with yellow color make sure your color is not too watery it should be on the concentrated side so fill your brush with yellow color like this and then at the tip of the brush so I'm using only one third of my brush to fill this with orange color so I'm filling the one third of my brush with orange color like this so I'm not filling whole brush with orange color just tip of my brush with orange color so the idea behind is you have to fill your brush with the lighter color and tip of brush with the darker shade now push your brush a little bit and create a pattern like this so i'm holding my brush straight and just moving my brush so that i can get this kind of petals so pointed start and pointed end so that for this what you need to do is without any pressure then apply a little pressure in between and then release slowly so that you will get petals like this now as you can see we we are getting two different shades of color that is yellow and orange and that's the beauty of two colors in the single brush or you can load two color into single brush to get different shades of color so do it in the single stroke only so that you will get different expression of the color and different expressions of the uh, shape of the petals as well so that's the beauty of the single stroke technique so whatever expression you are getting so keep it like that only don't overdo it and that is how uh, we have done our first flower now let's uh, add some leaf as well so for the leaf also i'm going to use two color so i'm filling my brush again with the yellow color and at the tip of my brush i'm using green color so it's quite simple and just apply a little pressure you can also move your brush towards left towards right to get little expression of leaves and as you can see we are getting two shades of color yellow and green likewise you can add any color whatever you want like sap green or light green or dark green or combination of these two whatever you like now let's start with the second color so for the second flower i'm using rose metal lake color and red color so for the pink color i'm going to mix white also in the pink color so that i can make it little uh, light shade of pink so I like to use white color to make it little concentrated as well as well uh, to make it on the lighter node so I am filling my brush with the light shade of pink and at the tip of my brush is red color this is uh, very concentrated red color and I have filled my brush with the light 
pink color now for the second flower i am just creating the ovary of the flower with the help of pencil just to limit my petal area now this time i am creating little different shape shape of uh, petal so i am going two times to create a single petal so as you can see you are getting two different shade that is pink and red together so you just need to move your brush towards left towards right little bit as per the petal shape you want and you will automatically get different shade of color so as you can see we are getting pink and red both in all the petals that we have each time whenever you feel your color is not uh, completely visible you can clean your brush again and do load your brush with the same color again and do it again so do not forget to clean your brush and repeat the process to create petals like this again so this is our second flower with the help of light pink and red color clean your brush load the colors again and create the petals again so you have to remember two things that the pressure on your brush and the color on your brush so this time we have created flowers like this so i am using only those color which goes well with each other and i am using only one brush that is size 8 round brush and it is quite easy for beginners and this in this video we are only learning how we can load two colors and i'm not uh, showing any advanced technique in this video this is only for beginners so that you can start with different color technique and in the upcoming videos maybe i can show you something uh, advanced than this technique like how we can load maybe three colors and how we can um, paint smaller leaves and flowers and all those kind of things so you can also uh, use very uh, different color like purple or green which not goes well with each other but it's totally up to you it's your painting now let's move to the third one for the third one let's create the ovary of the flower and uh, again i'm using the light pink color to fill my brush and for the tip of my brush i'm using purple color so this time i'm going to show you a few different uh, petals technique so you can go either zigzag like this so you just don't need to move your uh, brush smoothly just create a little zigzag pattern so that you will get a darker shade at the middle and the lighter shade towards the edges or else we can do one thing like zigzag at one side and smooth at another side so as you can see we are getting two different color that is purple and light pink so that is how you can paint different shades of uh, flower like this and you can also paint a uh, different shape of petals like this so either you can go only with the single stroke or you can paint flower with two stroke or you can paint flower with little zigzag pattern so it's totally up to you and now you have also learned how we can load different color into a single stroke so that you will get different expression of colors and it's quite simple to paint mm -hmm. 
now let me show you one more thing like how we can paint different shape of uh, leaves with this within one stroke technique so what you can do is you can paint one stroke leaves like this and then add multiple one stroke leaves to create a single leaf with a different shape like this so this is also like zigzag kind of pattern but i have added multiple single stroke to create this particular kind of leaf let's do one more time you can also add different shapes while doing it so multiple single stroke leaves to create one single leaf in different shape so that is how we did all these three flowers so hope you have learned how we can load two different colors into a single stroke technique and thank you so much for watching see you guys in the next video